What's up guys? This is GC Off-Road. Today I'm going to be doing a little project to my new daily driver. So I picked up a headlight restoration kit and I'm going to be using it to uh, brighten up the headlight lenses. So here's the kit I got. I just grabbed the Rain-X one. I use their products for cleaning the windows with and they work out pretty good. So I figured I'd go ahead and give the Rain-X headlight resto kit a try. We've got the buffing polish and protectant wipes. Comes with a pair of two gloves, a uh, foam polishing wheel, this little sanding attachment for a uh, drill, then some different sandpaper. So here's what the headlights look like now. They're not horrible, but they uh, are definitely oxidized. You can hear it rubbing over it and you can see the line here. So we're gonna attach the drill attachment to the drill and then attach the brown sanding disc. The uh, brown is the coarser one, so we're gonna start off with it. For sanding, you wanna mist the lens and the surface of the sanding disc with water from a spray bottle. Now, I've got a old mean green bottle that I've cleaned out. Just got plain bottled water in it. And we're gonna use that to keep everything wet while we're sanding it. So I'm gonna go ahead and wet everything down and start the sanding process. that the uh, oxidized orange peel feeling is now gone from it so I'm gonna wet it down real good go back over it again to polish it out some and then we'll move on to the next step I just got finished sanding it with the gray disc now I'm gonna spray it down and use one of these microfiber cloths. What we're looking for is to make sure that the whole lens is equally got a frosted look to it. As it dries, you'll notice it gets a little hazy, like it's frosted over. That's the look you want out of it after the first round of sanding. Now we're going to repeat those same steps with the gray sanding disc. That's the gray one. That's the blue one. See all that? That's all the oxidation and plastic off that headlight lens. So we'll move on to the gray one and repeat the steps one and two. All right, so I just finished up with the gray sanding disc. See, it's a whole lot clearer now. It's still a little bit hazy, but it's more blended out. There's just a faint line here where the oxidation was, and you can barely feel it. So now we're going to move on to the blue sanding disc. So I just finished up with the blue sanding disc, and this is what it looks like once I wipe it off. So go ahead and get the foam pad swapped out, get the polish open, and we'll get started on this. finish polishing it next step is going to be to wipe it down and check the clarity if it's not as clear as you'd like it to be you can keep repeating the polishing process until you reach your desired clearness so I'm happy with the clarity of it there's some imperfections in the plastic but it is a 15 year old headlight cover so uh, it's not gonna be perfect no matter how much I polish it it's definitely looking a whole lot better than it did when I started it's actually clear there's no yellowing left in it Step four of this process is to fill in the work that we've done. The kit comes with a set of gloves and a pouch that's got a protecting wipe in it. So once I get the other headlight done, we're gonna seal both of them at the same time. So as soon as you open that pack, it starts to cure. So you have a limited amount of time to do it. Now that I've got this side done, I'm gonna move on over and start on the other side. So I got them both done. I just opened up the wipe. And what you wanna do is you wanna wipe it down completely, make sure there's no dry spots. Now if it streaks while it's drying, they will dissipate as it continues to dry. And you don't want to expose this to any kind of elements such as car washes and stuff like that for at least eight hours. 
and you want to let it dry for at least one hour before you touch it. So I'm going to go ahead and start wiping it down. And it says to wipe all in one direction. So I'm going to go from the grill to the fender, wiping it out. So I just got the headlight lenses wiped down with the sealant. I'm going to give it an hour to dry and we'll come back and look at it. So here's what it looks like right now. Passenger side. Pretty clear. Anyways guys, I'm going to wrap this video up here. That's how you use one of the rain -X headlight restoration kits to clear and restore your headlights. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and check us out on Facebook and Instagram at GC Off-Road.